This video was made possible by EA Game Changers. Massive thanks to Electronic Arts for providing me with early access to this game. Let's play with Kore a bit. Oh, the hangi is the... Okay, you're going to be dropping so many Terrio words into your LP, or at least attempt to. Uh, all your videos for Island Living have started with Kia Ora and ending a <laughs> ending I I no hora. Am I saying that right? I no hora. I can roll the R's, so I'm hopefully saying it correctly. Ah, oh, so she is living on at the volcano. Can we go to the volcano? Oh, e no ho. Enohora. Okay. Yeah, see, I have no idea, so I don't know. Oh, man. But you can go up here. Let's go up here. So we started out in spring. That looks like... No, that doesn't look like it's going to bear any fruit. There are... Oh, I forgot to look at the new... Um, what are they called? Lock traits. Uh, the A, which was a typo, and you had it right. Okay. Why well, are put the same word? Yeah, the volcano is so cool. Um, I'm actually really looking forward to seeing how all of this works out. Yeah, that's... I don't know. I'm just keen on everything and I don't know where to go or what to start with. Because everything looks so good. Uh, there's no interactions here, so this is as far as she can go. Yeah, yeah, we're not browsing the web. Let's have a look at the new. Still laugh at that lady who was like, why would you live that close to a volcano at the airplay announcement? <laughs> All right, so we've got the volcanic activity. This lot is near an active volcano. Beware of earthquakes, steam vents, and occasional lava bombs. All right, we'll see how that goes. Then we've got new ones. So clothing optional with the spelling mistake in Moors. Uh, this lot embraces an open natural lifestyle. Although that's, um, that came in with the base game, didn't that? Then we've got, what else we got? Island spirits. Ancient island spirits inhabit this lot visiting frequently. How will Sims choose to interact with them? Do I want to give her that much strife? <laughs> Maybe what I'll do is I'll use the island spirits in the LP. I need to. Um, and then we've got the off the grid. This lot isn't connected to electricity or plumbing. So that came with the base game. Was there another one? Was it just the volcanic activity and island spirits that came with the... EP and then off the grid and clothing optional came with the I thought there were three there were supposed to be three that came with the island paradise but maybe not okay because yeah we I'm not really seeing anything Not really seeing anything. Okay. So yeah, that's the new lot traits. Do we have any new skills or anything? Let's, that's right. Let's have a look at the careers. Let's have a look at the new careers. And I think we'll have her become, I don't know. Um, there's oceanic paradise, but it's locked into certain lots and can't be placed. Oh, what's TLC? 
because somebody mentioned TLC before and I'm like, um, I don't know. I have no idea. So conservationist has the environmental manager and marine biologist branches. Okay. So I'm going to be doing that in my Let's Play. Then we've got the part-time. Oh, we've got the new diver and fisherman part-time jobs and lifeguard. So let's become, I think, a lifeguard. I love the fact that we've got all these part-time careers now and you can have like up to two of them. So in a way, we could be a diver and a lifeguard and we still get Thursday and Friday off. We still get two days off. So we can actually have... Oh, and we can choose whether we want the morning or afternoon shift. So you could literally work... Two sh like two jobs on the same days and and you could basically have like an offset shift that is amazing and at least do you know how we uh, get the second job so I'm gonna make her a lifeguard right that's Monday Tuesday Wednesday and we'll go the early morning one get the um, get the work over and done with because then when festivals start and that sort of thing, if she wants to go, they all start at 10 o'clock. So um, it'll actually give us the chance to attend those. So I'll make her a primary. I want to make her a diver and lifeguard. Once you have one, you can go look for a job and okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to be primarily a lifeguard. And then so she goes to work in four days. Oh, okay. So the red ones are the days off. Okay, so she's got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday off. So then we look for a second job. So she needs level two fitness skill. And then we can, oh, and she can find odd jobs. Oh, let's check that out. I mean, we've got no skills, but let's, let's just check it out. Oh, paid beach cleaning volunteer work need to be done by Sunday 4 p.m. In need of waxing. I need to hire someone to do some waxing. I want to take my darling to the ocean and I can't let my friend see her looking like she does right now. I have all the supplies, but I just don't have the time to do it myself. Don't you dare get a scratch on her perfect body. She's the best aqua zip a guy could ask for. Okay. So that one requires handiness level four and Thorn obviously paid beach cleaning volunteer work. So that's last minute beach party. So you need cooking level one for that. I'm hosting this huge annual beach bash and I'm pretty sure more people are going to show up than last year's. T totally going to need someone to bring some extra Kalua pork or else there's no way I'm going to be able to make enough food for everyone. Okay, so are there new foods? The odd jobs are interesting, yeah. Um, so you need mischief skill level four, photography level two. I saw a mermaid once, but nobody believes me and I haven't been able to find one since. I have a brilliant plan and a fin suit that I want to wear underwater. Looking for someone to take pictures so that we can prove to the world that they really do exist. Okay. Oh, wow. So that's fitness level one for moving furniture for Candy Bear. That is so cool. This traditional, so the cool is one we can make in the hungi. Oh, okay. So I guess I would have to make that, the Kalua pork, and then take it to, okay. Let, let's do that one. Because I can get level one cooking quite easily. Because you just start cooking and you get it. So let's let's make cook. Let's make a garden salad. Is that new vegeta vegetable dumplings? 
I can't remember having that before. All of these other ones I'm recognizing. Anyway, let's just make a single serving and um, just come on, run down. Make the salad and there's wild kaba shrub. Okay, nice. Yep, so she's got that level one. Oh, my coffee's gone totally cold. With the Chinese New Year update. Oh, okay. Oh, my coffee's gone totally cold. That's gross. Okay. Let's um let's put that in the fridge. And Why don't we travel somewhere where we can make the Kalua pork? Where would there be? Maybe here? Okay, so the other one is the Oceanic Paradise. That looks like that might be possible to use that fire pit there. Nope. But we can do some fire dancing. Okay, Ooh. so if I look in the jobs, cook Kalua pork and male Kalua pork. Okay. And that's due by 6 p.m. Sunday, so that's today. Ohanali Town definitely has a hungy pit. Okay. Yeah, off the grid is a great trait choice. People are complaining about the, um, what's it called? Um, off the grid uh, washing tub, I think. Because um, you can fill it and use it once and then... Mm, excuse me, I'm just eating an almond. And then you can't get the water out. Okay, so let's go to Ohanali. So it's this one has the Ohanali beach has the pit or the sandbar. Let's try the beach. It's a public lot. We can probably walk over to the other one. Okay. Yeah, look away. Love my lurkers. Mm. Okay. Do we have a hungry pit here? Not here. Hmm. I love that we're able to just kind of like look at the whole little area, the whole neighborhood. I am really not seeing the pit, the fire pit. But I love the way this is made. This just... All right, go to the beach and the pit is in the town square area. Okay. Ah, yes, here, okay. So, Grand Pit Barbecue, Kalua Pork. Oh, okay. 
Okay. And cook feast. Okay, so that we have like pineapple and taro root. Oh, that's right. There's several new. All right. Let's make that Kalua pork. Nice. Totally missed this area at the back. It's almost ready. <laughs> wow. All right, let's grab the meal. And then we're going to put it in the inventory. Or not. Put in inventory. Okay. So then we have to find a mailbox, I guess. Can we use someone else's mailbox or does it have to be our mailbox? Mm. All right, let's, let's just go home before the food goes off, mail it, and then we'll go hang out at the beach. Smell the Kalua pork. Yes, we've done the first odd job and got 156 bucks. Awesome. Nice. I like that. We don't have. We don't have anything. Let's find another. Come on. All right, back in the part-time jobs. So she works Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I need something that has Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Because she can have the evening shift. Or she could be an afternoon diver. That's it. Because currently. Yep. Yeah. All right. going to be working part-time basically five days a week <laughs> okay so she needs to reach level two fitness skill and she needs to purchase a diving knife 
from a diving boy. All right. Let's let's go to here. And let's check some of this stuff out. Let's let's sunbathe in her swimwear. <laughs> 